After being grounded by COVID, close to 100 balloons are ready to take flight this weekend. It's the New Jersey Festival of Ballooning, and CBS 2's John Elliott took an early morning ride in Reddington. You know, what do you love about taking a balloon ride? You know, people tell me it's the most fun you could have standing up. Okay, well, we're in the air. It's the feeling of, of weightlessness. You know, it's like floating, it's like a feather floating over the countryside or being on like a 16 story terrace, but the land is moving beneath you. You don't hear anything but the sound of the propane heating up the tank. There's nothing like it. Science meets spectacle as the forces of physics and the art of engineering combine to harness the heat of 175,000 cubic feet of air to take flight. Once you get the feel of it, it's like riding a bicycle. People get really excited. They, they say, oh, I can't believe it's like this. This is great. The most graceful flight you'll ever have. No turbulence, nothing. It's the most peaceful thing you'll ever do. If you look at these balloons, there's nothing rigid in them. Their beauty and grace is all due to the fact that they're flexible. When you're filled, then you take flight. Does this ever get old, Tony? It never gets old. Never gets old. Here we go. And hang on, we're going to stop it. There it is. We're going to stop it. What do you love about ballooning? Uh, I guess the people coming out every morning, getting a free workout. Um, it's just fun to do. It's beautiful. More kids getting exposed at early ages would be the best for the, the community. It would grow it so much quicker than it is right now. We have more than just hot air. Max Weinberg's jukebox, bare naked ladies, balloon glow. They also have the world's biggest cornhole game with bean bags bigger than me. After being away for two years, um, this is awesome. Things are looking up is our slogan. Gentle breezes and soft landings, we say. And bright colors. Yes. If you're heading to the Balloon Festival tomorrow morning, be sure to stop by and say hi to John. He will be at the festival beginning at 6 a.m. Playing the Wizard of Oz, John Elliott. That's yes, it. Yes, he is.